Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Eileen and today, wow, red hair. You know, I've fallen in love with the reds. I have really, really enjoyed wearing red hair and this color, wow, I can't wait to show it to you. This is Beltress Alpha Blend Heat Friendly and I'm going to show it to you in two different colors. First, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Please like and subscribe. I am trying to show you as many different colors, styles, and shapes as I can. Uh, when I first started doing wig reviews, I mainly wore pixies and blondes. And since then, over the last couple years, I have really tried to branch out to longer styles, all kinds of colors. I wanna show you everything. This channel is about you, not about me and showing you everything available so you can make an educated buy. So you can see everything about a wig and, and then make a determination, do you want to buy it or not? So that's my, my mission here and that's what I'm working toward. Okay, let's get started and look at Beltress Alpha Blend. First up, Beltress Alpha Blend, Heat Friendly, and the color Sumptuous Strawberry. Wow, what a gorgeous color. I want you to see all the aspects of this wig. Now, for me, this wig is a little long. I feel like this is a little much for me. However, I can see why this is so popular with so many people. This is a beautiful shape. The fibers are the beautiful, I love Beltress fibers, and this is no exception on this one. They are lovely, they truly are. I want to read you the color description for Sumptuous Strawberry. So I have it written down here. I want to read it to you, and I want you to look at this color. They describe this as pure red, strawberry blonde, a hint of paprika and honey with some copper undertones, medium brown roots, and honey under hues. Now that is quite the color description. <laughs> I think sometimes we get lost in these huge color descriptions. Uh, I know I do. Sometimes I'll read all that. I'm like, oh wow, I, that's almost too much for me. I don't, I'm not sure. So I just want to show you this color. I'm also, also going to have both of these colors. I'm going to show you in outdoor lighting. So keep in mind, we use these, these studio lights and they um, are hard to show color. They wash out the color a lot of times. So always know I will show you my colors in outdoor lighting. So up close, I want you to look at Sumptuous Strawberry. Now, yes, there's red in here. Strawberry Blonde. Beautiful pieces of Strawberry Blonde. There is also some Honey Blonde, I believe, running through here. Really nice on the brown root. Now, the root is excellent. Look how well blended this root is. It has a lace front. I'm going to pull this up and let you look at this lace front. The fit is excellent. I really don't see my bio hair on either side of this wig, and that's unusual. I usually see a little bit of bio hair, but on this one, I do not. So I feel like the coverage is excellent. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference. Now, my face is nine inches from hairline to chin, and we'll get into the specs of this a little bit later, but I just really wanted to focus on this color for you. One thing I think Beltress does so well is blend these colors. And again, I will show it to you in outdoor lighting. Okay, so like we said, this has a mono part. I want you to see that. A lace front. I'll show you the inside of the cap in a few minutes. Alpha Blend's going to have these sides of 13 inches. The nape is 5. The back is 13 also, so it has a overall uh, specs of 5 to 13. So 13 inch sides, 5 inch nape, 13 inch back. I also feel like the sides of this are, at the ends of this are a tad choppy the way they done it. When you pull it back, you can see that just kind of blunt on the ends, not a real smooth. Uh, in my opinion, I see some bluntness to this, and I think that makes it really edgy and nice, very on trend. 
Okay, let's look at the inside of the cap and a few ways to style it. Here's a look at the inside of the cap, lace front, left mono part, the smallest amount of permatease. This is a nice low density style. Ear tabs with stays, felt ear tabs, open wefted, a non extended nape with pull adjusters. And there's a good bit of stretch in here. And here's another look at Sumptuous Strawberry. You can see that copper, I believe, here a little better. And the highlighting and the red tones. Very, very well blended. Okay, here is a look at Alpha Blend in Cream Soda Blonde. Now, I want you to see this color up close. Notice how this is highlighted around the face. Just want you to see that all the way to the lace. Now, I know some people do not like that, and some people do. So, I'm just calling it to your attention that this is heavily highlighted around the face into the lace front. Now, the description from Belle Tress of this is blend of sandy ash and light blonde with a hint of satin blonde and that is a perfect color description in my opinion. It does have a little satin blonde in there. It's a very sandy color and it is highlighted heavily around the face with light blonde. So I want you to get a good look at that and again I will insert some outdoor lighting. Now the fit of this, I want to let you know, this fits me large. Like I said, I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference and this fit me pretty large so I definitely will have to use the adjusters to pull it in. I have not adjusted it, I just took it out of the box, but I would have to on this one. It, on uh, Alpha, Bl Alpha, Alpha Blend, it fits me quite large. Just so if that helps you, if you have a larger head circumference, I believe this would work really well for you. But this is a gorgeous color, cream soda blonde. Really pretty. I like the ashiness of this. I prefer those kind of blondes. And if you do as well, you might want to have a look at cream soda blonde. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this alpha blend in two colors. Uh, please, again, like and subscribe. Be sure to follow me over on Instagram, and I'll see you next time.